stand here so you can see all the fine people. We'll let you use this Right here? Yes. Awesome. Alright. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Bill Allman with the BC Entertainment Hall of Fame. And tonight, of course, we have a very special induction into the hall. Hall of Fame is a not-for-profit organization. We have so far 275 inductees all along Granville Street. Stroll, <coughs> stroll, look at the stars, and admire the people for the talent and the gifts they bring to the city. Tonight, we induct Todd Kearns. Out <laughs> time, damn it. Into the BC Entertainment Hall of Fame. In support of his induction, I am delighted to see actually several other BC and uh, Hall of Fame members here tonight. Really? Yeah. And this is, yeah, cheer for them, please. <laughs> the list of, no list of nominators to support this induction was truly a who's who of the entertainment industry. Now, you probably already all know this, but I get to do a little bit of a bio. <laughs> Lucky for us, Todd calls British Columbia his home after spending most of his formative musical career in Vancouver. He was the front man for the band Age of Electric. Yeah. Receiving a gold record for the album Make a Pest a Pet. That's right. So far correct. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fact check me here, please. <laughs> Todd has also appeared on numerous albums, solidifying himself as one of Canada's most dependable vocalists. Sure, He's produced and written with numerous artists. Internationally, Todd has been able to bring attention to the BC music scene while on tour with Guitar Hero Slash. <laughs> He's also joined projects with Bob and Bruce Kulik of Kiss. <laughs> and performed with Raiding the Rock Vault. Wow. Yeah. Resulting him in getting the key to the city of Branson, I did. Missouri. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. May not have been legitimately, but I do have it. A lot kicks to the key. Yeah, exactly. yeah, that would be good enough. Yeah. To further Canadian music on an international stage, Todd, along with other superpower Canadian musicians, have created, I love this one, two. They're covers of the best love Canadian that. rock are some of my favorites. <laughs> and some of them are better than the original records. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I don't see Mike Greeno, I'm safe. <laughs> and now to say a few pers <coughs> Puberty. To say a few personal words about Todd, will you please welcome his personal manager of over 20 years, who has flown up here all the way from Redondo Beach, California, Cheryl Hall. <laughs> Perfect. Wow. All right. 
Uh, please welcome, holding the plaque, Christina Potter to assist in the presentation of certificate and the BC Entertainment Hall of Fame inductee pin. The certificate reads, this is to certify that Todd Curran, ultra applause, it says it. <laughs> was duly elected by his peers and is now a Starwalk member of the British Columbia Entertainment Hall of Fame. As such, and for all to note, a plaque bearing this member's name and discipline has been embedded in the Starwalk along the sidewalks of Vancouver's Theatre Row. Further, a photograph of Todd now hangs on the star wall located in the beautiful Orpheum Theatre. <laughs> Henceforth, only members shall be entitled to wear the exclusive BC Entertainment Hall of Fame membership pin which Christina is going to present Todd, designating their outstanding contribution to British Columbia Entertainment. And now, we're going to reveal your star. Oh my god! Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much, and uh, hope you have a blast tonight. It's going to be completely nuts. <laughs> 